What's going on YouTube? This is Cab Over Gary back with uh, some maintenance today. Uh, today I need to change all, all the brakes on my uh, little trailer. This trailer has two 10,000 pound single tires on it. GVW 24,000 pounds. It's been a great trailer. Uh, fortunately, whoever did the brakes last, uh, did something wrong and it ripped all the magnets out of them. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to get that changed so this trailer's good to go again. And, uh, first thing to do is get it up in there so I can take the tires off. So I use my handy dandy jack that I call Bob. My 1950s era, maybe 60 era, uh, Case W5 front loader forks on it. I put one of the spare tires under the ramp. Holds these are torsion beam axles so they're both off the ground. Uh, first lug nut was a little corroded coming off so I just lubed them all with a little bit of PB blaster. So now I'm gonna break them loose with my DeWalt impact. Take all the tires off and then uh, work on taking the drum apart. Okay, so I took all that off, which I showed in the last video, except for this, where you just unbolt those eight bolts, and the, this whole assembly comes off as one. So I got to splice back into the trailer brake wiring. Something looks a little funky here. I'll have to look into that. But uh, then after that, you put the new one on, bolt it back down, put the hub back together, and you got brakes again. All right, so this side, or this brake is all, spindle's all cleaned up. All the bolts are in. Uh, this is a assembly that you get. You just unbolt the one and put the one on. So pretty easy to do. Just make sure that this arm is pointed forward. That's the side of the brake. There's different left side and right side. This is always forward. Magnet's always at the bottom. As far as I know, there could be some oddballs out there, but uh, yeah, and it says left hand on it. So uh, I'm going to clean up the drum, get the bearings back in it, get the seal in and slide this side on and this brake will be done. I do the back one and that other side and then uh, I'm waiting on the hub oil to show up. Hey guys, it's hot out here, so I had to move my shade tree over. Put a pout on Bob and just moved it over the wheel. Now I got some shade. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm adjusting the brakes. So, on the back side here, there's two plugs here. I pulled them both out to, because I didn't know where the star wheel is. But if you look in there, that here right there you twist that up and it opens up the brakes and what you're after is a light drag let's see i think i'm gonna leave i think i'm gonna do one more twist Yeah, feeling pretty good about that. So that's how uh, that's adjusted. Now the wire, this being a torsion beam, there's not as many moving parts. So this wire drapes over the inner here, zip ties there. And so guys, basically you repeat that process for the rest of the wheels and uh, Make sure you got a good little drag on it and uh, that gets you all set up. Uh, I'm gonna end the video here. Uh, I lost a little bit of footage as I was finishing up, but uh, I think it gives you an idea of how to do trailer brakes. And uh, now I'm in West Texas, at, uh, staying at my friend's shop, 3G Fabrication, and uh, hauling potatoes. And I'll get you guys some footage of that 
please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and comment and like the video if you like it. And uh, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.